Hello! In this video, I'm going to introduce Quizlet, a website that lets users create study tools to help them learn anything. At its heart, Quizlet is an online tool to help learners. Students can sign up for a free account and create flashcards for any subject, play games related to the content they're learning, and test their knowledge with both written and audio feedback. Quizlet has obvious benefits for language learners. In this tutorial, I'll walk you through some of its features. The examples you'll see here are for native speakers of English learning beginning German, but the functionality of the tool will work for any language you might be trying to learn, though some of the features like audio playback are not available in all languages. To begin, you must have a Quizlet account. Fortunately, signing up is free and it's easy. I'll sign into my account now. Now that I'm signed in, I can create my own study set or search for other study sets other people have made. I'll quickly create a new study set called German Colors to demonstrate how easy it is to get started in Quizlet. As I type the vocabulary words into the fields provided, Quizlet will automatically detect the language I'm studying and ask if its guess is correct. In this case, I'll click Yes. I'll then continue to fill in the fields with the German color on the left and the English color on the right. For each item in my study set, Quizlet allows me to add an image by clicking on the Image button to the right of each item. Quizlet automatically searches for possible images that match the terms I've entered. I can select one of theirs or I can upload my own. Once I've selected an image for each item in my study set, I'm ready to save it. To do that, I just click the Create button. Now I'm ready to begin working with my study set. The different things I can do with my study set are listed at the top of the screen. Flashcards allow you to use your study set like standard flashcards, but these flashcards will also provide audio for you to hear the words being pronounced. When I click the flashcard button, I hear the English pronunciation. Green. When I flip the card, I hear the German pronunciation. Green. When I advance to the next card, I hear the pronunciations for that term as well, first in English, then in German. Red. Rot. The next way you can use your study set is by clicking on the Learn button. In the Learn tool, you can test your knowledge of terms by filling in the blank. Quizlet will let you know if you got the correct answer or if maybe you made a mistake. In the Speller tool, Quizlet will say a word for you and you will have to spell it. This feature allows learners to test their hearing comprehension as well as their spelling skills. Grün. Rot. Schwarz. Blau. Gelb. When a user completes a task like I've done here, Quizlet provides feedback letting you know how well you're doing. The test tool simulates an actual test with fill in the blank, multiple choice, and true false questions. When you've completed a test, you get immediate feedback, knowing what questions you got right and what questions you may have missed. The final tool I'll demonstrate in this tutorial is the Scatter tool. This is a game in which users can match the corresponding terms by dragging them together. Once you have a match, the terms disappear. Your goal is to match each pair as fast as you can. In this video, I've demonstrated just a few of the many features that Quizlet offers language learners. I hope you'll take the time to explore these other features and use this tool in your own learning. Good luck!